We're going to catch up now with Gwen Stefani. Her first solo album in eight years is out later this month. And this morning, we're premiering an exclusive sneak peek of her new single, Spark the Fire. She also opens about her music, motherhood, and old friend Pharrell Williams with our friend Cam Matheson. And boy, is she ever. I'm a believer, no, I don't pretend. Grammy award-winning singer Gwen Stefani is blazing her way to the top of the charts in her new single, Spark the Fire. Who got the lighter? Let's spark the fire. Who got the lighter? Let's spark the fire. Here's a preview of her new video, which shows Stefani dancing in a club. Her thoughts conveyed on screen by emojis. It's kind of a clash of, like, this punk rock kind of old school feeling, um, like club feeling, but this really modern like emoji world. It just looks really cool together. Her latest single is her third collaboration with longtime friend Pharrell Williams. To have him back in my life again um, unexpectedly has been just incredible. I keep calling him the Yoda meets, you know, Oprah because he's got this forceful, like amazing way of speaking and inspiring you. Finally remembering what is me. That is what happens when I get with me. It's been eight years since Stefani's last solo album, and she says this one was unexpected. And all of a sudden, I'm doing this, like, record, which I definitely did not plan. That's probably what I love most about it, is not knowing and just kind of being free and just doing it and, and, and letting the surprises happen. Apart from music and fashion, Stefani also juggles life as a mother of three. Her children often weigh in on her new music. I do use the kids for like bouncing off songs, like to be like, is this one gonna be big? Like, do you like this one? And Kingston will be like, you gotta make a song that's like gonna be really big, mom. We say no. I swear, like, even Apollo is like, who got the lighter? And he goes like this. Here we go. Well, there's no doubt her latest single will spark the fire in her fans. For Good Morning America, Cameron Matheson, ABC News, Los Angeles.